Greetings, Professor Hobo here with some channel news and an update from Blue Eddy. So first on the agenda, 100,000 subscribers. Yay, we finally did it. Hobo Tech is a real YouTube channel. It only took four very, very long years and pushing many hours every week to make it happen. But we eventually got there. Big thanks to all that supported the channel over the years. I mean, two years ago, I thought I was going to call it quits, that this channel was doomed. Fortunately, I took a big risk changing formats and it worked out in the end. Jackery has offered to do a giveaway for this event. They want to give away some products, so I'll likely take them up on that offer, so stay tuned for details about that. I will do a live stream once I get my silver button in the mail. That seems to be a tradition for most channels to live stream the opening of their silver button for 100,000 subscribers. So we'll definitely do that and make it a special clinky time event with Billy. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> so if you're not subscribed yet, be sure to do so so that you don't miss the event. Again, thanks to all the original Hobotech crew that has stuck around with me since the very beginning and to all the new folks who are hopefully learning a lot by being here. Okay, for those of you that don't know, the Kickstarter for the Blue Eddy EP500 ends Saturday morning at 9 a.m. Pacific time. That is on May 21st, which is tomorrow from the time this video comes out. This will be your last chance to get this massive and incredibly awesome 5100 watt hour beastie at the low early bird price of $27.99. After 9 a.m. tomorrow, Pacific time, May 21st, the campaign is going to switch over to in-demand, and the price is going to increase to $31.99 for the base model or $41.29 for the pro model. And Blue Eddy has given away some freebies if you jump into this at the last moment. If you order the EP500 or the EP500 Pro before the campaign ends, you'll get a free Blue Eddy AC30 solar generator, if you order a pair of these, you'll receive a free split phase fusion box. Again, this offer is only available till 9 a.m. Pacific time on May 21st. I also have an update on the power consumption of the EP500. Bluetti has done three firmware updates on this model since I received it two months ago when I did the original video. There were a lot of concerns from some of you about the standby power consumption of this. So after all those updates, they actually tweaked the standby power on this so it's less than half of what it was when I first got it. It's actually better than the AC200 model that came out last year. So the current consumption on standby with AC and DC turned off is around 11 watts. And with AC and DC turned on, it's around 22 watts. This is down by almost half of what it was when I originally did my review two months ago. So this is excellent news for those of you who plan to run the EP500 for long periods of time under low or no loads. Now for some even better news, Blue Eddy is sending me a second EP500 and their fusion box, which allows you to connect two of these together to put out 220 volts. And that also allows you to plug into an RV and get the most power out of two Blue Eddies. Unfortunately, shipping took several weeks longer than expected as I had originally planned to do a dedicated video on that combo before the campaign ended. I will do a dedicated video on how to hook up a pair of EP500s with the Fusion Box sometime next month. I'll also do a video on the new dedicated EP500 app once it's installed. I didn't do a video on it originally because they were using a temporary app for this model, but this new model that I have coming in is gonna have the new app and I'll do a video dedicated to that because that's what you guys are gonna see in the end. That allows you to do all kinds of stuff on your phone, control the Blue Eddy from a distance as long as it's on the network and you can turn it off, turn it on, change all these parameters, it's actually pretty cool. I'm also gonna do a dedicated video on the complex UPS feature of this because this has several settings including an advanced mode which allows you to do all kinds of crazy programming on it. So. I'm going to do a dedicated video just for that. So stay tuned for a lot of EP500 goodness. This is really an amazing product, and I know once you get yours, you'll be very happy with it. So if you're interested in snagging up the EP500 or EP500 Pro before the 9 a.m. deadline on the 21st, just click the link in the description below. That takes you over to Kickstarter where you can snag it up before the sale ends. After 9 a.m. tomorrow, the link's gonna change over to their in-demand store where the price is going to increase. So you'll still be able to buy one after tomorrow 
but the price is going to be higher. Thanks for watching. If you learned something today, don't forget to give me that thumbs up below. And if you're not a subscriber already, you know what to do. That's it for now. Till next time. Odin commands you to like and subscribe and clean my litter box. Yeah, Billy says I work too hard. <laughs> Let's go fishing. No, I gotta do videos. Oh, let's go shooting. No, I gotta do videos. <laughs> <laughs> what, you don't like solar generators? Uh, the, the, yeah, they're good. <laughs> In limited quantities. Yeah. 100,000 subscribers, yay. Yeah. Finally made it. You guys that don't know, Billy's been around since the very beginning. Yep. Scratching around in the dirt. Poor as hell. <laughs> yeah. Come a long way. Yep. Goes to show you what hard work and no fun will do. <laughs> <laughs> All work and no play makes yeah. for a sad hobo. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> yeah. A lonely hobo. Yeah. Billy's single, by the way. <laughs> For all you ladies out there, now I gotta put this on there. Yeah. RV Golf Guy at Medicaid Repair. Andrew Von Rupp, Richard Cardano. Yeah.